What is up my fellow mobile gamers? In today's video, we got our 1v1 tips in NBA All World. Like and subscribe, greatly appreciated. Really cool trick that I wanna just go over is the fact that when you go to a rule the court, you can actually just kind of leave, go home, and continue to play rule the court or a pickup game over and over again. You don't actually have to be at the location. However, if you do click the X button and leave the court, then you will have to be at that location. So it's a really cool cheat code. Farm up a bunch of team rep or experience points or just rule the court and get to that number one spot if you're just farming up the bots there. Very, very awesome port. So we're gonna do a pickup game because this is a really good way to kind of practice your 1v1 skills. It's also a real good way to get experience points for one of your players. Also just to farm up team rep, credits, pretty much anything. Now the problem with doing this method is the fact that your player's energy level is eventually going to deplete and you also won't be able to kind of upgrade them. Once they do have enough experience points, you upgrade to the next level because you have to leave the court in order to go to the other menus. That's the only downside. So here we go. So our 1v1 tips, all right, so for offensive, we have two jab steps. We have our right jab step and we have our left jab step. Now you'll notice if you do like this right jab step, see how we move the defender so far to the right? Do the animation and then do the crossover. So basically what you're doing is you're tapping on the screen on the left side or right side to do the crossover animation. And then once it's finished, you're going to do a slide again to kind of give yourself space. And then you're gonna go forward in order to uh, create the dunk animation. Stealing is really a gamble. I really don't like to steal uh, because I feel like stealing is really hard. I think it's a lot easier to just kind of wait for your opponent to take a shot and then try and block it. So now we'll go ahead and we'll do it again. We'll go jab step. Now watch this, we'll go a swipe. Now you see, we're gonna go uh, right side, fake it, and then one other, and there we go. So that's it, it's very simple. You just kind of want to tap on the screen. And then once you see your defender go one of the ways, you're then just gonna use your slide to then move your character either left or right to get a little bit of space. And then you're just gonna go forward. So like, I, I just, I don't know. I think stealing is too much of a gamble. You have to have like a character who's really good at stealing. So usually I just kind of wait for the computer to do something. And then I pretty much always block their shot. It's very, very simple. All right, so we're gonna go like this, watch this. We're up, see, just, all you gotta do is look for a little bit of space. Once you see that kind of gap, once you just have that like player just have a little bit of gap, then you can just blow by them every time. No, you do have to be careful when you're facing shorter players who have really good steal because almost nine out of 10 times, they're gonna just strip the ball from you when you try and drive to the lane. So you see, we got team rep, we got a bunch of credits and we got some energy as well. And that was it, that was pretty much free. And we can kind of just keep doing this. We don't even have to be at the court. So look, we can go ahead, do another pickup game. And I mean, you can almost farm this endlessly. Uh, one of the biggest problems I've been having is team rep, just because team rep is like the biggest bottleneck that you need to accumulate so much before you can get to your next team level. Um, so that's my biggest problem. But the fact that we can kind of do this little cheat code and kind of just do rule the court and then keep doing pickup games over and over and over again to just accumulate lots of team rep, this is like the best. All right, so now let's go ahead and we'll do another one. So always do the jab steps first just to see what gets your opponent moving the most. Like, all right, so see how he's, all right, so we're gonna go like that. And once we get him off, we're gonna do a move and then one move, oh, he's not even near us. And that's an easy jab, that's an easy drive to the lane. Very, very easy. And when you are trying to steal the ball though, you wanna make sure that like the person, the player isn't in like the middle of an animation. You wanna do it when like, you're kind of lined up better. So like if you if they just have the ball right in front of you and they're dribbling it, that's like the best time to try and steal it. See if I can get like a good example. Um, so offensive is just so easy, right? We'll do a jab step, we'll do our slide, we'll do a move to, we'll, we'll tap here, we'll go like this, we'll slide, and then we have an easy layup every time. Very, very simple. Tap, slide, and then up. Uh, be best way to kind of uh, throw it down there for you. All right, so let's see if we can get a good steal example, all right? So let's see. Um, usually just wait. Now see, he was going, that would have been better to try and block that shot. Um, it's just really hard to steal in this game. It, it used to be really easy. I mean, like ridiculously easy. 
and then they kind of like nerfed stealing and made it a lot tougher. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go uh, tap to the left, slide, and then straight to the lane. Super duper simple, it works every time. Tap, slide to the same side, or you could do a tap and then slide to the other side as well. Uh, but you see his energy really didn't go down that much. So this is a really good way to farm up team rep. Um, unfortunately, he is maxed out. Also, star tokens. You can get some star tokens as well. They're kind of like a random drop when you're doing these. But this is another great way to kind of farm up star tokens. We just got three right here. You'll see, unfortunately, though, his experience is maxed out right now. So we won't be able to level him up. However, you can still gain experience points. Um, it just keeps accumulating over and over. So literally, this is what I do. I come here. I go to a rule of court, there's one right by me, and then I just go ahead and just continue to do these pickup games over and over and over again from the comfort of our home. We don't have to worry about freezing our butts off outside because it is really, really cold where I am right now. Got a ton of footage I uh, did already, and I gotta cut down and edit and throw up videos, so there's gonna be a ton of videos coming at you very, very soon. We found LeBron James out in the wild. We're gonna have a video about that, tons of stuff. Stay happy, stay safe, and I'll see y'all later. Peace.